There is a light in the eyes of an indigenous child, a beautiful life once hidden from sight, but now standing proud, shining light onto lies. They buried our children in unmarked graves, Indian boarding schools where they claim to save the man by killing the Indian in us. Pride our mouths open and stole languages. Claimed manifest destiny was heavenly, then prohibited our prayers. But today we unearth what is truly holy. Sage smoke got her lifted, can't stop her, she's gifted. Overcame attempted genocide, keyword attempted. All these years of oppression, bring out your feathers and dust them. The grace of our elders reminds us that love wins. Love wins against hate embodied in those who called themselves free. Then named us animals in the doctrine of discovery. But you cannot discover a people who already exist, and you cannot find something that was never lost. When history is written by the colonizers, they are always the heroes. So we rewrite these books with stories that we know. They plundered our wealth and burned down our orchards, then turned around and labeled us impoverished and worthless. They told us we were nothing, then held us as captives when we're the ones who gave the world corn, rubber, and aspirin. Boarding schools cut our hair. The nuns had their whips cracking. They came and went like lightning, but look who's still standing. Settler systems rise to power and then crumble. Like a stone, we remain because we're taught to stay humble. We were called stupid and primitive by the world's colonial forces, but the world can thank our people for 60% of global food sources. We have always known who we are. Scientists, artists, astronomers, deserving of dignity, overseers of 80% of the world's total biodiversity. Across the land, prayers of ancestors come to fruition. Beautiful indigenous minds working in unison towards the same vision. Peeling off these labels like a butterfly born of resilience. We outstretch our wings, the world finally ready to embrace our brilliance. Colonization proves that hurt people hurt people, but heal people heal people and nourish the future. We're the seventh generation, we're forgiving our abusers, breaking the cycles and healing the tumors. From Turtle Island to Abya Yala, all our knowledge comes through her. With feet on the land, we honor our roots. We stand here today calling out to Native youth. There's a light in your eyes. Walk tall and shine bright. We're not here to survive. No, it's our time to thrive. You shine like the sun. You are always enough. The prayers that we make and the actions we take will nourish our descendants generations from today.